Hello, I'm Eno Harris here with Carlene Koskinen. And we're back with another episode of SHS Today. Redefining Beautiful is a weekly event where girls come to school completely natural. This means we don't wear any makeup and we reveal our true and natural beauty. Grace went out and got the details behind this school-wide event. Hi, I'm Grace Kaufman here to tell you about the girls who are bringing true beauty to Selene High School with a group called Redefining Beautiful. Redefining Beautiful is a group I created to help raise self-confidence amongst our peers in our school. I hope to be able to raise, you know, girls and guys in our school self-confidence, show that you don't have to hide behind makeup to be beautiful. You can go on Facebook and join off of the Redefining Beautiful page, or you can contact me and just wear no makeup and a t-shirt on Tuesdays. 70% of girls between the ages of 15 and 17 don't even bother to participate in everyday activities due to their lack of self-confidence. In the USA, 92% of young women want to change some aspect of their appearance. 9 out of 12 girls have seriously considered suicide, and 11% have attempted it. I decided to join Redefining Beautiful because uh, not many girls know their true beauty, and they cover it up with makeup, and a lot there's a lot of pretty girls out there, and I believe that natural beauty is a beautiful thing, and you should show it and not just cover yourself with makeup. Every day in our society, girls are pressured to meet a standard of what our multimedia culture says is beautiful. As a result, they don't see how truly beautiful they are. From all of us here at SHS Today, you're beautiful. Back to you, studio. The informational meetings for Redefining Beautiful will be in the guidance office after school today and Monday at 2.50, and then another one on March 1st before school at 7.15. Check out the Facebook page for any updates. In other news, this year's musical, West Side Story, debuts tonight starting at 7.30 p.m. in the high school auditorium. Can't make it tonight? That's all right. There's another show again tomorrow night at 7.30 and then another on Sunday at 2 p.m. I know I'll be going to tonight's show. On February 9th, Selene High School students gathered to compete in the fourth annual Poetry Out Loud contest in the Performing Arts Center. Congratulations to Adrienne Johnson for her first place win with the poem Scary Movies by Kim Adonisio, and to Katie McMorris and Alana Heinbaugh for their second and third place wins. Some of the other participants in the contest were Shannon Frazier, Brenna Hines, Ben Quino, Kevin Anderson, and Katrina Eziani. The Poetry Out Loud National Recitation Contest is for high school students throughout the nation to memorize and recite poems with a dramatic flair. 200 people attended, including teachers, administration, judges, and contestants. This year's contest raised $158. The proceeds from the event went to the school's literary magazine, Writers, Inc., and DVDs of the event are available for $5 through Mr. Bush in room 244. This episode of SHS Today was brought to you by The Edge. Come to The Edge, open during all lunches and after school until 3 p.m. New this year are Nike sweatshirts, Nike crew neck t-shirts, and Under Armour products. There is also other merchandise from apparel, coffee mugs, lanyards, and keychains to popcorn, candy, and pop available after school. Come check out The Edge. Looking for a new hobby? Want to get some exercise? Come out for the Spring League of Celine's Ultimate Frisbee Team. Their next scrimmage is tomorrow, February 26th from 6 to 8 p.m. at Liberty School. New and inexperienced players are welcome. Pick up a registration form in room C205 or see Mr. Dice for details. The forms are due by March 14th and the games begin March 27th. That's all for today's show. Here's a final montage of this year's talent show. Have a great weekend, Hornets. <laughs>